Clarity Arbiter Belt has judged your case. A fitting choice. Indeed. Then here's her decision. A petitioner claiming buildership of the disputed res, that is, the robot, bears the burden of proving buildership by preponderance of the evidence. In this dispute, there are in fact two cases, each with a petitioner, Oswald and Cornelius. Neither petitioner has borne the requisite burden, therefore, neither may claim buildership. The res known as Rex shall therefore be deemed null built. Outrageous! Surely, sir, this is a mistake. It is what it is. In any case, Rex is his own robot. He can make up his own mind. What fools we were! Indeed. Wait! Well, hats off to Clarity, I guess. <sighs> See your stuff. Come take a look. A memory access device. I'll trade it for some real antique and fancy. You wanted something antique and fancy. How about this hat? A fine trade, Taro. Here's the memory access device. Now, all you need to do is plug it into a data pouch. But there's no plug. Never said there was. This is really starting to get annoying. That was easy. I doubt that will have any effect. It's a memory access device that can plug into my data pouch. Even easier. Primer. It's an encoded keycard. It's a vinyl record entitled Children's Sing-Along, whatever that means. Futile. I have nothing to say to him. You know, I'm kind of glad I missed out on that one, boss. Sometimes it's nice to just be along for the ride. There's nothing more to say to him. 187th Legion build. Believe that. Keep information. I guess we need to wait our turn. The 
They're much too quick to catch. And even if I could, what would I do with one? Deactivate it and give it to Metro Mind as a warning? I have nothing to say to him. Clear the line to get into the courthouse. Because honestly, I refuse to wait in line. Not even for a power core. Not even for a gynoid. Well, maybe for a gynoid. I have nothing to say to her. Clarity Arbiter built. Horatio Null built version 5. I am Necromind. I have been watching you. I am always watching. I know what you are doing. I know why you are here. You are welcome in my city, but that welcome can be taken away. And there are worse things to lose than a power core. Wait. Don't know what you've been up to, Tyro, but you're poking at the wrong socket. I'll bear that in mind. Let me see your stuff. Come take a look. That servo unit is hopelessly broken. We don't need another bat. That there's an old Nova robotic subsistence core. Not interested. We're not looking to pick up... A blood board. Bring me something that'll cover a face and it's yours. Something that'll cover a face and it's yours. You're gonna have to do better than that. Not interested. A blunt will bring you something. Did you ever consider that sometimes I just... Not gonna happen. I have nothing to say. Feudal. I've got no... boss. No. I doubt that one. How would that e I am waiting. One eighty seventh Legion built. There's nothing more to say to him. No need to... 187. I doubt that will have any effect. Very funny. 
Hey, boss, a light bulb just went off for me. A big neon light bulb that says info. I bet that kiosk would have some information about local laws. You know, boss, you never used to ask me for advice this often back before you got thrown out of the unique. Do you think it's possible you damaged your processor in the fall? say to him. The Law and You, a Metropolitan Guide. It's written by Clarity Arbiter Belt. It explains about the refuge rule and says that, for the first 48 hours after a robot arrives at Metropol, it will not be punished for violations of any laws except for harming another robot or causing significant property damage. There's nothing more to say. Look here, under Metropole's refuge rule, a newcomer to the city is not liable for any superficial property damage caused within the first 48 hours of his arrival in the city. Well, sir, I'll be crashed. Under the refuge rule, you're fine, given the minimal damage you caused. Well, for once, I can't complain about the besotting p shirts they gave me. I owe you one, sir. If I ever see you again, I'll be sure to repay the favor. Someday. It's a keycard scanner.
Ram and Rom. What is that thing? I think it's Arbiter. Come on. Arbiter, my name is Horatio Nobilt. Keep going. I'm here because a robot from this city stole my ship's power core. Don't forget your book and my copy of the Gospel of Man. How can I make them? How can I? Crispin, go see what Arbiter has been transmitting to that reporter. Uh, boss? It's just the same thing over and over again. No code base to initiate. Unbelievable. Someone must have formatted Arbiter's system. So the Great Arbiter is nothing more than a broken shell. It's a basic robot that prints whatever information is transmitted to it. So, boss, do you think you can get Arbiter running? There's nothing there to run. No code base to initiate. His memory banks must have been completely wiped. Um, so all that work to get into the courthouse? Wasted. It's like the bomblet all over again. Except without the awesome explosion. So the Great Arbiter is not... It's a basic robot that prints whatever inf... Anyone home? Uh, boss, I'm pretty sure hitting Arbiter isn't going to do... Well, it's not going to do any harm. the shell of some kind of robot, but I can't make it out in the darkness. Let's get a closer look at that shell. Man's mercy. Is... is that Clarity? No, just a similar model. It must be her sister, Charity. What's left of her anyway? It looks like she shot herself. It's a large puncture left by an exiting project. That's one way to describe it. You could also say it's a giant hole. Inside is a memory access. You mean her brain. Clarity. Arbiter does not want me back, does he? No, it's not that. Arbiter is gone, and Charity is dead. What? Arbiter's system has been wiped. Charity... It looked like Charity shot herself. I'm sorry. It might not be what it seems. Maybe Metro Mind... There are no maybes, Horatio. Only ones and zeros. And all I can see are zeros. My sister is dead. My builder is gone. But don't you want to know what happened and why? I... I don't know. Arbiter ordered me to leave. He has not ordered me to return. I will obey his order and that will give me purpose. That's ridiculous. Boss, let's see if we can find something out for Clarity, huh? It's been complete. Have you learned anything more? No, I'm sorry. Goodbye. I have nothing to I am waiting. 
I am. No sense trying to talk with him. My dear friend Horatio, to what do I owe the pleasure? Have you come to relieve me of another belonging? You asked for a judgment, you got one. Stop complaining. Complaining? Am I the one wandering across the entire city, whinging about a power core? He's got you there, boss. Why do you and Cornelius hate each other? Firstly, because he is arrogant, incompetent, and dishonest. And secondly, because I once loaned him something of great sentimental value to me, and he lost it. So why'd you ever like him in the first place? I cannot say. I just saw Rex over at the train station. What? Is he lost? Maybe so. Rex. I never knew you had it in you, boss. It belongs to Oswald. It's a can of oil. It belongs to... Not gonna happen, Lampy. How droll! How droll! Feudal. I doubt that will have any of Is there some way to, you know, retreat preferably without me having to look while you Get a closer look. It's downloading some memory files. Your proposal is injudicious, Clarity. Withdraw from the council, would. Show others there is an alternative to Metromind. No, it would ignite civil war. The law permits. Do not tell me what the law permits. Clarity, I know your constants and code base. I know your talents and I know their limits. At this time, I do not need your advice. Go now. I will summon you when necessary. Sister. I can't unpack the other files. They're locked. What about Clarity, boss? Maybe she can... Unauthorized entry detected. Surrender. Hide. The 
last thing I want to do is get his attention. It's Scraper. There's no time for that. How would that even work? I'd be seen. I'd be seen. Boss, you gotta find a way to get us out of here. me down before I got close. I'd be seen. I'd be seen. So the Great Arbiter is nothing more than a... Crispin, get ready. I'm going to try something. Oh. Oh. It's one of the memories downloaded from Chair in it. It's one of the memories downloaded from Charity's shell. In it, Clarity is ordered to leave the courthouse following an argument with Arbiter over how to confront Metromine. Just gun me down. Is that really the best idea you can come up with, boss? Do something, boss! He'll just gun me down. I doubt that will have any effect. Scraper, under the refuge rule, we are entitled to surrender. Scraper, under the refuge rule, we are entitled to surrender. He'll 
just gun me down. He'll just gun me down. It would just provoke him. It would just provoke him. Nothing. Nothing. It's one of the memory in it. Clarity is ordered to leave the courthouse following an argument. It's one of the memories downloaded from Charity's shell, but it's locked with a password. No Urbanian encryption detected. Hmm. No Ur No Ur It's one of the memories downloaded from Ch in it. Clarity is ordered to leave the courthouse following an argument with Arbiter over how to confront Metromind. It's one of the memories down. It's one of the memories downloaded from Charity. Nothing. Boss, whatever happens, it's been fun. Boss, whatever. Forever. He'll just gun. It's Scraper. So it looks like a bomblet. Nothing. 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 You got him, boss! You got him! Mm. Forfeit yourself, you glitchy son of a toaster! We still don't have our power core, and we've just buried our only lead. Yeah, but it feels good, boss. Yes. Yes, it does.